Hello, you are welcome. How to simplify this problem? Square root of root 186 plus root 40 plus root 140 plus root 56. From here, we can rewrite this and this will become square root of we have root 186, that's 14. Then plus, we can write root 40 as root 4 times 10. Then plus root 140, we can write that as root 4 times 35. And uh, plus, we can write root 56 as root 4 times 14. Then we have this can also be separated, and this will be root 4 times root 10, also root 4 times root 35, also root 4 times root 14, and the root 4 is 2. So we can rewrite that, and then the next step this will become square root of we have 14 plus here it will be 2 root 10 now, then plus here it will be 2 root. 35 now then plus here it will be 2 root 14 now and uh, in the next step we can also write we can bring these two outside because we have 2 2 2 we can factor it and uh, this will become root 14 then plus 2 outside now we have root 10 plus root 35 plus root 14 and then in the next step we can write this root 10 root 35 and then root 14 again and this will become root 14 let's write 14 as 2 plus we can write 14 as 2 plus 5 plus 7 that will give us 14 then plus we have 2 into bracket root 10 we can write that as root we can write that as root 2 times 5 then plus also root 35 we can write that as root 7 times 5 then plus 14 can be written as root 2 times 7 and then now here we can rewrite this and this will be square root of we can still leave this as 2 plus 5 plus 7 then plus 2 multiply by when we separate this we have root 2 times root 5 then plus here we have root 7 times root 5 and we have plus root 2 root 2 times root 7 now from here what we have here we can see it as in form of represented a as root 2 and then we represented b as root 5 and we represented c as root 7 and from here we can get a square so a square b equals to 2 when we square both sides so b square here is equal to 5 and c square here is equal to 7 and we should note this identity that when we have a plus b plus c all squared so this will be the same thing as a square plus b square plus c square then plus 2 into bracket a b plus b c plus c a and then in this format what we have inside this root follows the right hand side here yeah? that is we have a square plus b square plus c square and a square is 2 b square is 5 so we have 2 plus 5 plus c square that's 7 then plus 2 multiplied by we have a b that's root 2 times root 5 then we have b c that's root 5 times root 7 and that's c that's root 7 times root 2 then instead of writing this now we can write simply write this now and then we cannot say we have root 
in that format now we have root a plus b plus c then all square such that square we cancel square root here and uh, what we have left will be a plus b plus c and this is a this is b this is c therefore we can conclude that here we are going to have root 2 plus root 5 plus root 7 as a solution as a simplified form of this problem thank you for watching please share these videos and also give a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe as well see you in the next class and bye for now